2021 was a very tough and challenging year, but our company's resilience and resourcefulness were evident throughout. Despite volatile global economic factors and the ongoing disruption and trauma of the pandemic and lockdown, we succeeded in amplifying our strengths and improving our productivity, performance and total shareholder return, the latter by 34%. The way we responded to the challenges with real commitment, empathy and efficiency strengthened our overall reputation this past year and bodes well for our future. We have in fact become a great example of a business that strives to be responsible, sustainable and ethical and on behalf of the board I'd like to warmly congratulate and thank Ian the Exco and all Mutualites for this achievement. What is particularly pleasing is the fact that long-term thinking and environmental, social and governance factors are now well integrated in the business and are playing a pivotal role in our investment decisions and operations. The board's foremost strategic focus is ensuring that Old Mutual becomes our customers' first choice to sustain, grow and protect their prosperity. This year that entailed making sure that the group strengthened the market conduct framework, which ensures that customers are treated fairly and that this applies across the entire business. Further enhancements to our customer servicing were made by leveraging our end-to-end -end digital capabilities and artificial intelligence tools. Supporting Old Mutual's overall progress has been the culture change initiative, which we call Project Pulse, and which is driven by the human capital team. With the full backing of the board, Old Mutual has been enhancing its leadership development, energizing employee talent management, and instilling a culture of caring and innovation. An ongoing focus area for the board is monitoring the response readiness of the business to a wide range of risks. The events that took place in the provinces of KwaZulu-Natal and Gauteng in July 2021 were a wake-up call on the risks of exclusion. This highlighted the need for both firmer leadership and better collaboration between all social partners, especially government and business working together to build an economy that is more inclusive, just and stable. In our role as custodians of savings and investments across the continent, we already provide disadvantaged families with opportunities for social mobility and intergenerational wealth accumulation. We are determined to bring well-being within the reach of many, many more. The group's efforts to drive empowerment and transformation in the financial services sector included the sale of 21.2% of the old mutual investment group, that's OMIG's share in future growth, and this sale has gone to the African Women's Chartered Accountants Investment Holdings. Significant progress was also made on the environmental front this past year. Apart from formulating a solid climate change strategy, we published the group's very first public disclosure on the frameworks we are putting in place in support of global decarbonisation goals. I'd like to assure you that as one of the largest asset managers on the African continent, with 1.3 trillion rand in funds under management, we consider addressing the climate risks a top priority. Accountability has been formalized at the board and executive committee level and we've joined both the Net Zero Asset Managers Alliance and the Net Zero Asset Owners Alliance, two fundamentally important alliances that will oversee uh, our commitment to decarbonization. The board is also pleased with the outcomes of the various legal challenges instituted by the former Chief Executive Officer bringing this matter closer to a final conclusion. Lastly, I'd like to sincerely thank the outgoing board members, Peter de Baia and Taste de Toy, for their many years of great service. And I'd like to welcome Yaku Langna and Nomkita Nguyani. We are confident that these excellent appointments will add great value to our board, which continues to stand up to tight scrutiny. May Old Mutual and its remarkable people continue to do great things for all our stakeholders every day. Gia Bonga, Riali Bucha, Bayadanki, thank you 
Asante sana.